in. Let us solve this question using the same formula C equal to K into P. Therefore, 6.56 into 10 to the power minus 3 divided by MC to H6 will be equal to K into 1. Mark this as equation number 1. Here, MC to H6 means molecular weight of C to H6. Similarly, 5 into 10 to the power minus 2 divided by and C to H6 is equal to K into P C to H6. Mark it as equation number 2. Divide equation number 2 by equation number 1. We get 5 into 10 to the power minus 2 divided by 6.56 into 10 to the power minus 3 equal to P C to H6. Therefore, the partial pressure of C2 H6 on calculation comes out to be 7.62 bar and that becomes the answer of this question. Finally, I would like to deal with an objective question. That's our question number 4. The question is, the Henry's law constant for the solubility of nitrogen gas in water at 298 Kelvin is 1.0 into 10 to the power 5 atmosphere. The mole fraction of nitrogen in air is 0.8. The number of moles of nitrogen from air dissolved in 10.0 moles of water at 298 Kelvin and 5.0 atmosphere pressure is the options are A. 4 into 10 to the power minus 4 B. 4.0 into 10 to the power minus 5 C. 5.0 into 10 to the power minus 4 D. 4.0 into 10 to the power minus 6 Let us solve this question. Since this question deals with mole fraction Hence, Henry's law permit must be partial pressure of nitrogen equal to Kh nitrogen into Xn2, where X means mole fraction of nitrogen. Further, Pn2 required is equal to its mole fraction into total pressure and that is equal to 0.8 into 5 that is 4.0 atmosphere and Henry's law constant for nitrogen is given as 10 to the power 5 atmosphere therefore we can write an equation that is 4 equal to 10 to the power 5 into x and 2 x and 2 the mole fraction of nitrogen in aqueous solution on calculation comes out to be 4 into 10 to the power minus 5. But we know that mole fraction of nitrogen is equal to Nn2 divided by Nn2 plus 10, where small n means number of moles of nitrogen and 10 stands for the number of moles of water. Since Nn2 is going to be a very small quantity, therefore it can be neglected in comparison to 10. So we can write 4 into 10 to the power minus 5 equal to Nn2 divided by 10 or number of moles of nitrogen equal to 4 into 10 to the power minus 4. We see that the option A becomes the answer of this question.